God's Word Speaks Healing is a unique audio compilation on which Pastor Benny Hinn reads promises of health and wholeness from throughout the scriptures as beautiful instrumental music from his favorite healing songs and hymns plays in the background. For I am the Lord that healeth thee. You can have God's Word Speaks Healing on CD for a gift of $15 or as a digital download for a gift of $8. Call, write, or order your copy of this faith-building volume online today. something about his name saints kings and kingdoms one day will pass only his name lives forever and through that name salvation is yours through his name miracles happen and healing is yours there is no other name that can save and heal. There is no other name that gives you peace, hope, joy. Darkness vanishes when you mention his name. Bondage breaks when you speak his name. Sickness is gone when you mention his name. For in the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow. Every tongue will confess. Jesus is Lord. For the glory of God the Father and his wonderful presence is here right now. Lift your hands and forget your troubles. Forget your diseases. Forget the problems of life and love him now. And kings and kingdoms, they'll all pass away. But there's something Once again, Jesus, there is something about Master, Master. to the instruments and kings and kingdoms they'll all pass away but there's something but there's something
Jesus name above all names beautiful Savior glorious Lord there's such a blessed presence of the Lord here there's such a precious anointing in this house this is the moment to just surrender Lift your hands to him. Come on, saints. Jesus, name above all names. Just close your eyes now. Close your eyes. Jesus, name above all names. Name above all names. Beautiful Savior. Glorious Lord. Glorious Lord. Emmanuel. God is with us. Blessed Redeemer. Living Word.
that's why come on this is a doctor who came tonight to be healed and the power of God just came on him I said all of you stand up and the poor man began standing up and I said please I understand you can sit down this is a doctor and what did they do to your foot they amputated a toe I was bit on the toe by a brown recluse spider and the poison got into the bone which got into the marrow they had to amputate and that poison affected my kidneys my liver and it gave me something just happened to you ah when I said stand up you just did this and I felt so bad for you I said please sit down I understand you now and then he tells me I'm a doctor I'm a scientist I came here tonight I checked myself out of the hospital to be here start walking and I just laid hands on him People, the Lord is in this place. Lift your hands up high. Come on, one more time. For you are... Hey, doctor, come here. Name of Jesus. Pick him up, guys. You're the Lamb. Every bit of that, every bit of it, every bit of it. Every bit of it in the name of the Lord. Come on, lift your voice. And unto you we lift our voice in praise your land. Pick him up. See, as we're worshiping, the Lord just healed that the doctor. And you said three of your patients are here? Two of your patients, you, you brought them? They came on their own. Uh, they, they heard I was going to be here, and they somehow got to... Uh, is this your first time? My first time here at this location. I used to work the buses to go to your crusades. So you, uh, you checked yourself... You're a doctor, and you checked yourself out of the hospital? Yes. A doctor who checked himself out of the hospital. Father, heal your people tonight. Just like you just touched this wonderful doctor. Injury, knee injury, who had healed two different meetings in a row. For the, so the back four weeks ago and his knee Wait, wait stop, ago. stop. What happened to you tonight? Come here closer, please. Four weeks back that I came here for the first time. And uh, I had a work-related injury on my back and my knee. Four, four weeks back, I was healed in my back. I was able to bend, and uh, but I didn't want to testify on that day. I wanted to go home and check. I went home and I was able to. I was able to bend, and you know what I was not able to do. And uh, two two weeks back, I came back to testify, but I was late. I was sitting outside in the lobby. Suddenly, I heard a pop on my knee. And uh, I, I was not able to bend this knee, and suddenly, like, it was released. I was able to move. You were in the lobby the last time. And what happened tonight? And tonight, again, I felt the power of God on my back. And just then, you called out, your lower back is being healed. So I just felt I just needed to testify. Lord Jesus, I thank you for your mercy tonight. Now, people, there's a... There's a very strong healing to, uh, atmosphere here. Let's lift your hands and receive it. In the name of Jesus, every bit of it. Every bit of it. What happened to the young man? So two separate accidents caused pain in his ankles, feet, knees, thighs, and a serious injury in his back, three millimeter bulge. All of it healed tonight. Wait, just repeat that to me again. I was in a car accident when I was 17 years old. Um, we were hit, um, we were going like 10 miles per hour and like a, a taxi hit us and it, I wasn't wearing a seatbelt. It almost killed me. Three millimeter bulge in my back for life. Comes and goes, it was an attack by the devil. He tried to kill me and I was saved. God didn't let me die. 
He saved me, he wanted me here, and, and I don't know what it would have happened. I didn't know God very well, but then I was saved, but the pain has been gone. And my skateboarding... But what happened tonight? Tonight, all that pain from, from the skateboarding, the car accident, I feel it burning when I was up there. I could feel it. You told me to put my hands on the area, and it was all gone, all of it. Check it out. Okay, huh? It's, it's all gone. None of it. I don't, my legs feel like solid steel, like strong, and my back is... Dear Jesus, dear Jesus, dear Jesus, dear Jesus. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling, I'm feeling that all over just for you, brother. Help him up. Move, move your legs up and down and... Somebody say, praise the Lord. Can we give the Lord a mighty hand of praise? Him? Well, for you are great. You do me recall so great. There is no one else like you. Let me hear the pipe. There is no one else like you. Come on, saints. For you are great. Let me hear you sing it, Father. Like you, young man, you can go back and bless you. There is no one else. Pick up the key, please, for your grave. For you are great. There is no one else like you. Three months ago, she tore the muscle in her left knee. And tonight, the power of God came on her. Wait, wait, wait. One more time, she tore the muscle. She, one, three, she tore the muscle Jesus, in her left Jesus. knee three months ago. She was in pain on the way over here. Every bit now of she's it moving in it. Jesus' name. <laughs> For you are great. You do me recall. There is no one else. There is no one else. For you are. Let me hear your choir. I don't know where this lady was sitting, but whoever was sitting close to her, I think it's next to her, had troubles with your neck. And if you'll move your neck, it's gone. I don't know where, where, where she was sitting. Help her up, we, we can find out. Where were you sitting? Somebody right next to her or, or not to, has had problems with, you, with your neck. Is that you? Well, move your neck. Is the pain gone? She says, wow, get up here. <laughs> you deserve the glory. Let me hear, hey, hey, by, by, by the way, you've just joined the choir, all of you, okay? So come on, you deserve. Come on, oh, both of you, both of you. You've had troubles with your neck? Huh? Why not? I could move my neck all the way to the left, whereas before I couldn't. Wait, just wait a second. You were not able able to move your neck before, but you could move it all the way. And just just now, it just fixed, got all fixed. Oh, praise the Lord! <laughs> Aren't you glad? The the anointing on her when God healed her came on you. That's uh, sometimes when God heals someone. At the same time, he leads someone next door to him, and they don't even know that they're healed. Yeah. Uh, yeah. She says, aren't you glad she sat next to you? Or is it the other way around? Yeah. Lord. Oh, dear. Here you go, ladies. Okay, choir, come on. You deserve the glory.
Lord, the Lord just gave her a double healing. Not only the neck, but she, she's had some sciatica right here. And she said, okay, check it out, good. Pardon? It seems fine now. Well, let's keep it fine. Thank you, Jesus. You can go to your seat. Somebody say, praise the Lord. I'm going to believe God with you today for your miracle, your healing, yes. and your deliverance. Jesus. With me is a mighty man of God, a great anointing on him. Pastor Coy Barker and I go way back. Way back. Some of the greatest miracles I've seen were in I've his church seen. in Oklahoma City. But let's believe together right now Amen. for the people to be healed. Amen. And then you're going to give them another word yes. and yes. pray for their finances. Yes. Sweet Jesus, we give you oh, praise, God. Lord. Heal your people, mm. Lord. They've seen your power today. That's Heal your people. We rebuke that sickness. We rebuke that disease in the name of Jesus. Somebody, a growth on your, on your, on ne on your neck That's it, is Pastor. going down. That's Thank it. you, Lord. That's it. Yes, Jesus, a blind right eye is being mm. healed. Skin cancer, we rebuke Thank it you. in the name of Jesus. Thank Throat you, Jesus. cancer, somebody with cancer yes. on your vocal yes. cords, we rebuke Jesus it. Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name. A lady, arthritis, severe arthritis in the back, mm. lower back. Mm. Be healed in the name Lord, of Jesus. Lord. I see a lady, uh, Speak, man of God. very, very uh, strong and only mm. uh, that mm. you're, you're feeling on you, dear lady, for your healing, uh, mm. your lungs, your mm. lungs. Mm. Oh, dear Lord. Now, I'm getting a name. I never got that name before. Alberita. Yes, yes. You must be Hispanic. Yes. Spanish. You're, he you're being you, healed Spirit. of your Holy lungs Spirit. in the name Jesus of name. Jesus. The greatest miracle is salvation. Thank you, Father. If you don't know the Lord, just pray right now. Dear, yes, Jesus, dear Jesus, I'm a sinner. I'm a sinner. Lord, come into my heart Lord, and save my soul. Save my soul. And wash me with your wash precious me. blood and make me, whole. make me whole. I give you my life give and I'll serve life. you for the rest of my days and forever. Amen. 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 Dear God, that anointing is still here. Like a cloud. I'm telling you, talk to the people. Let, let me and just, pray for them that the, yes. their finances would be healed and yes. they'd be delivered. yes. The, the Lord is, it, you know, I understand the Bible said in 1 Chronicles 12, if you know the season, you understand the times, then you know how to move. That's right. And I have heard from God. I understand the season. I understand your season. I'm here for you. I love this man. He opened this door for me to come here, but I'm, I'm going to speak to you. I'm here because God sent me on an assignment to your house. That's right. And here's the word of the Lord to you. In this Bible that I have spoken and preached around the world many times out of, for over four decades, I've seen every kind of miracle you can imagine, financially, spiritually, physically, from just simple steps of obedience. Now listen, this what God said to do right now is so simple and so profound till it's amazing to me. 50 in the Bible is a mountain number. It's a number that changes things. It talks about grace. It talks about favor. It talks, when you talk about 50, you're talking about jubilee. Jubilee in the scriptures means brokenness is healed, family members saved financial woes broken off of your life. Abundance comes to you. Here's what the Holy Spirit said. And I, we talked about it, Pastor Benny and I, and in agreement. It's very biblical. It's very biblical. That's right. And it's a God thing that is ready to happen for you. God said to give you an invitation to go to your phone right now, take your credit card, your bank card, dial that number, or go on the internet Go to that protected, safe site. Give to this ministry $50. I literally believe there's thousands of you that's going to get miracles so suddenly just by that simple step of faith. 50, liberty. 50, freedom. 50, household salvation. 50, favor. Somebody's been trying to get a contract signed. You need the favor of God. Right. I'm asking you to go right now. Dial that number right now. When you dial that number, you make a connection. God honors actions of faith. I know in my own life, when I've operated by faith, 
I moved at an instruction from a man or woman of God. My life was changed. Instantly things begin to happen. I am a living miracle right now of restoration physically, spiritually, financially, every part of my household. I am a living picture, photograph. If you go the the dictionary and you look up restoration, my picture is going to be there because I am living that and whatever I have is coming into your life. God's going to release it into your life. I have seen the impossible. I have seen the the supernatural. I've seen cancers disappear. I've seen the crippled limbs made whole. I've seen all kinds of phenomenal miracles happen. Cancer ripped out of the body Mm. when doctors have said there's no hope. Simply by an act of faith. You know what I'm asking you to do? Jam the phone lines out right now as an act of faith. Step out of that comfort zone. Step into that arena. Put that seed in this moist, anointed, holy soil in the kingdom. I'm telling you, this is your God moment, and you cannot, you must not hesitate to go that phone. Can you pray for him right now? Yes. I just break the spirit of poverty. Amen, Lord. I come against that spirit of lack. I break that demonic stronghold, and I release abundance. I release health. I release family, miracles of salvation. I cause it to come in the name that's above every name. It is done. Run to the phone. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Run to the phone and say, here's my $50. I need a miracle. Tell us what that miracle is. We'll believe God with you. We'll believe God to work quickly, suddenly in your life. But we love you. Thank you so much for obeying God. Thank you for letting me be here. I'm loving it. And make sure to watch again Friday. It'll be on a very anointed word. I mean, listen, I was was trembling while I was ministering. Hallelujah. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Another great program. Love you and keep calling. And remember, your miracle is running. Yes, it is. Suddenly. (laughs) Thank you.